Hey everyone, welcome to my February favorites video. So I missed last month, so unfortunately I did, was not able to do a January favorites video, so it's been a while. The last one was December, obviously, that's what came before. But I'm so excited to do this month. I can't wait to share these goodies with you guys. So let's get right into it. First on my list this month is something absolutely awesome. This is the Clinique Chubby Stick Sculpting Highlight. And it's a number one, it's a hef It's called Hefty Highlight. So this is a makeup product, obviously. All it is is it's a highlighter. And I have some other highlighters, but I didn't really realize how awesome a stick was compared to like a powder. I like the powder, which I still have, but this is awesome. I use this every day, even if I don't really put that much makeup on and I just want a little bit. I'll put this on the center of my nose, a little bit on my forehead and my cupid's bow and right on my chin and a little bit on my cheeks. And it's so easy and it goes on so nicely and I just love the color. It's not too overwhelming, but it's really, really nice. So next I have a new perfume. Obviously it's a Marc Jacobs perfume to add to my collection. As you can see, it's little spot is it's right there on my shelf. This is um, by Daisy Marc Jacobs. It's the E So Fresh Blush. So he came out with a collection of the blush collection for around Valentine's Day. So there was this one, the E So Fresh Blush, the Daisy Blush, and Daisy Dream Blush. So I have not gotten those yet, but my mom surprised me and got this for me for Valentine's Day. And it is so nice. I love the little bottle. Obviously, these are my favorite per perfumes. That's why I choose to specifically collect his and this just smells so nice. I'm not a huge fan of fruity things but this is really really nice. I feel like his are just enough and that's why I fell in love with his collection of perfumes. That's why I still get them all the time whenever they're released. So these were limited edition so if you want to get one of these definitely get your hands on this quickly because he does not release them for that long when they're a limited edition one like that. Okay, so next is a hair care product. This is by Bumble and Bumble. It is called the Pret a Powder. I've been kind of trying a lot of different dry shampoos recently. So, and then I always seem to come back to this. I've had this for so long and it's lasted me forever. I haven't used it. Well, I guess it's lasted me because I haven't used it that often, but this tops everything that I've used. Besides a few dry shampoos that I really like, this is awesome because it's part dry shampoo, style extender, and it gives volume and it smells really good. So if I tend to like style my hair in any way, after I'm done styling it, I'll go back with this and put it in my roots and just kind of fluff it up a little bit. It'll give me a little bit of volume and it's a dry shampoo so it'll remove any extra product or grease looking, you know, strands like that. So this is just an awesome thing. I really, really recommend this. Okay, and next is another Lokai bracelet, guys. The purple Lokai bracelet that they just released. It's um to it's for, I have a little tag here so I can remember. It's for Alzheimer's. So I think this was really great. I know for me personally, this one speaks to me because my grandma had Alzheimer's. Um, so I just, you know, they always pick such great causes to do these for. That's why I love the bracelet, but I really do love the cause. And they're just so cute. So I'll link that down below. They don't tend to keep these very long because they are limited edition. So if they're no longer available, I'll link the original one, which is just the clear one. So at least you guys can get that one if you don't have that. Okay, next is something small and I actually left it on its container so you guys can see it. It's from Claire's. It's a little hoop earring. That's all it is. And I actually got my cartilage pierced. I got my cartilage pierced back in August and it was not my favorite piercing to get pain wise. Mine kind of hurt for a long time and I was kind of afraid to ever change it. But I love these little hoops. They're really in style right now and I just really, really wanted one. So I'm going to be brave and I'm going to change my earring finally, even though it's been so many months, but I'm going to change it to this. So I just really like this and I wanted to make it a favorite just because the little, the whole like hoop thing is really popular right now. And like the specifically the little hoop, like putting a hoop in all your ears just looks really cool. Okay. So this next one is actually really funny. <laughs> I'm just going to tell you and then I'll explain. So the next one is from Godiva. And it was the pack of chocolate covered Oreos. You get five chocolate covered Oreos. And I cannot tell you 
I was waiting specifically to record this video on this day because I had some exams this week and these were just sitting there on my desk looking at me, I swear to God. And I was trying to be so good, I was like, no, I have to be able to show them for the video. Oh my gosh, I have no self-control. I, I would go over and I ate one and I'm like, oh, that was so good. Okay, no, but I won't eat any more. And then the next day I had another one and then I just kind of kept eating them. So this is the wrapper. <laughs> I did save the wrapper. If you guys love chocolate, literally, these are my favorite thing Ever. I love Godiva. They have the best chocolate in my opinion. Palmer got me these for Valentine's Day So, you know, that was a really long time for me to try and wait and try and not to eat them They were so so good. So if you love chocolate buy these seriously I think they're better than just eating a little thing of chocolate and I'm not a huge Oreo fan Like I I like Oreos, but I'm not gonna go buy a thing of Oreos and sit there and eat them kind of thing But this is a game changer. This is amazing. You've never tasted anything like this so, it's one of my favorites this month, okay. I'm gonna stop talking about this. All right, and next I have another makeup product. So this is from Tarte, and this is the Inner Rim Liner. So all it is is this little eyeliner. If you guys can see it, it's kind of, here, I'll put it on my hand. It's kind of hard to tell. It's really hard to tell. I, I mean, you guys probably won't be able to even see it on my hand, but it basically, it matches your skin tone, but it's a little bit brighter. And so what it's used for is it's for the inner corners of your eyes and it just pops your eyes. It's so awesome. And I had read about this. Um, for some people it worked. For some people they didn't really notice much of a difference. Um, I, however, I found a huge difference. I think it's really, really great. Instead of putting a powder there, this like holds all day and it gets right in there so you can really put it in your inner rim. Last week I made a beauty hacks video and this is actually in that video. So if you want to see that, go check that video out and I'll tell you more about this there. My next favorite for this month is actually a store and it is called David's Tea. So I'm not really a coffee drinker and I never have been. I really like tea though. So um, I have Tivana, which is a place that I've always gone to, which has fresh teas and they give you like the tea leaves and then they show you how to brew it and you can make your own teas and you can mix them and make all different flavors. And I love that. I think that's awesome. And then a place opened up in the mall, right actually near Tivana and it's called David's Tea. And this is a place that actually when my boyfriend and I went to Canada, I saw that David's Tea was there. So that was cool to see it there. I didn't know what it was at the time, but it's cool because it didn't start in America, I think. So what I'm showing you guys is a little booklet of love tokens that my mom gave me for Valentine's Day. And it actually gives me five cups of tea to share. So what I really like about David's Tea is it is very similar to Tivana, but they do things like this and they have different flavors. So it's pretty cool. And like I said, it's new to me. So I thought this would be a great favorites. Um, if you guys like tea, I would definitely suggest checking it out. Okay, so this next one, I may or may not have shown you guys already, but, but this is a skincare product. It's by Dr. Dennis Gross, I think. And these are very cool. These are actually pads that are peels. And so I've had this for a little while, but I haven't really ever tried it. I really love what this does to your skin and I've used two of them already, but this is what it comes in. It's this little packet and there's actually two wipes on each side and it tells you what to do. You have a step one and a step two. So what it is, is it's, it's a great way to remove the dead skin off your face and it brightens your face, it shrinks your pores, it does all of those things. But it's one of those products that I used and I was instantly surprised at the results from it. I thought it was amazing and it feels really good. This is just a really, really cool thing. So I wanted to share this with you guys. Um, they do sell these little packets so you get three treatments in it and I think it's like $16 for the three but trust me, it's really worth it. Again, though, it depends on your skin type because I've used some products that people said were absolutely amazing or life-changing, and then I don't really notice as much of a difference on me, particularly. This may or may not work for you, but I really found that it did. Okay, and last but not least, I'm actually gonna share one of my Valentine's Day gifts that my boyfriend got me, and he got me this lush gift set. 
called Lots of Love. And as you guys probably know, I love Lush. I love everything that they have. And I love these gift sets because they give you a variety of their products. And they usually give you something that's limited edition that they only have out for the specific holiday or just specific time frame. So I was so excited when I got this. I'll show you what's inside it. So when you get a Lush gift box, you get a little piece of paper that says what's in my box. And it just kind of describes what is in there. I can show you everything except one of the bath bombs. I did use that one on Valentine's Valentine's Day. It was called the Titsy Totsy Bath Bomb and it's in the shape of a heart and it actually had little flower petals in it so when you put it in the bath they all were floating in the bath. It was really cool. It gives you a sex bomb which happens to be my favorite bath bombs. This is my absolute favorite one. It's got a little like tool up in the center. And one of the limited edition things that it comes with is this soap. It's in the shape of a heart and it's a rose and it's called Roses All The Way Soap. The next one is this soft coerer massage bar. So it's this little heart and um, I haven't used this yet, but I went into the store and the guy told me a little bit about it. A massage bar, you basically take it and you warm it up in your hands and then it starts to get oily and you can actually use it as like a massage oil. So that's very cool and it's really moisturizing for your skin. Next, I got this Rose Argan Body Butter. It's a skin conditioner and it's in this little tube here. So this, really, this smells so, so good. This I actually already had, but it really makes a huge difference and especially this time of year because it's so dry outside it's just hand cream it's called love and light hand cream and then last but not least this is cool this came out for valentine's day it's the the kiss lip scrub and this is really cool it's very sweet and I have a lip scrub, but you can see how pink it is, oh my gosh. I have the Mint Juleps lip scrub, which I love. I use that every day. This is really, really cool. It's so sweet and it tastes like candy because these you can actually eat when you put it on your lips. You can lick it off and eat it and it tastes really good too. All right guys, so that is it for my February favorites video. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to my channel. Keep an eye out for more of these. I obviously, I will do these every month even though I didn't last month which I again apologize for and let me know if you guys have any questions or comments leave your comments down below if you have any of your own favorites that you wish to share I would love to read your comments so I'd love to see what you guys are interested in and as always my products or anything that I mentioned in this video will be listed in the description so be sure to check that out thank you guys so much for watching see you next time bye